it's a seal catfish or gaff top we call it i'm going to clean this up first you got to take the beakers off the skin scrape it well wash it out let's cut out all the whiskers the little fins yeah, up on top of the side i'm going to score it about you know an inch inch and a quarter let me use a nice chopper or cleaver and score it real fast and hard this way it cuts right through look at that clean cuts you know we love this little jelly fin too i'm turning by the back because in case i was checking for eggs it didn't have any breaking our catfish a lot of people feel that it's hard you know i just want to show how easy it is and how you can save as much meat as possible very very simple just work in small pieces as you can see how i did this one here coming around to the head a lot of people just throw all this away and this is usually where a lot of meat is you just gotta take your time you know we don't like to throw away the head because there's a lot of meat the juice in the head that we love it's always been a delicacy in the caribbean and guyana where i'm from It's so easy to cut and get the gills out. Some people usually cook the gill, but I didn't cook the gill. I'm just going to cut this back up into two more pieces and we're done. See, that's a gill. And this little side piece here, it's got a lot of meat, so we don't throw that away too. Catfish is a simple fish to prepare. I'm setting all this up today because tomorrow, hmm. I'm going to season this up tonight, put it in the fridge. I'm cooking a nice fish curry with some green mango and some saijan. Saijan is also called moringa. So I got some fresh ones in the yard. Let me finish up here now. See, this is the side, the side meat. Very nice. And this piece, I'm just going to cut it out. Yeah, right here. Good to be precise with the cuts because then you get a lot of little bones fall in the pots of time. You don't want that with the kids. See? All nice. Lovely. Oh, this piece of gear. Let's gotta pull that out. Catfish meat itself is soft and the bones and the whiskers and stuff, so it's easy to clean. Alright, you gotta go wash and clean this up with some lime and vinegar. Then I'm going to drop some nice season on him. I'll wait till you see this recipe tomorrow. You're going to be licking your fingers. I'm just going to season this up, but I'm going to continue this in my other video. So stay tuned for that. It's coming up tomorrow. Curry, catfish with saijan and green mango. Stay tuned, guys.